Engaging with the young people in the community is central to all of the work that I do. Um, it's very challenging at times. Um, young people can be hard to reach, but predominantly partnerships and working with um, different agencies is the key to identifying and working with the young people that need to be reached. Uh, the successes in terms of my work has been engaging with the school um, in the local area. They've been very forthcoming, very open, and been able to give me uh, access to the young people that they feel um, who need to support. In terms of working with young people, it's, it's important to understand the starting point. It's first of all understanding their needs, I mean, which there are quite a range. I mean, young people refusing to go to school, not, not attending any other services. They may be have, working with other agencies, but maybe not engaging with them. They're taking a lot of risks in, in, in their life, particularly in relation to health. Um, and also, I mean, take the, the opportunities in the, in the communities that they come from mean that they're um, engaging with people who they possibly otherwise wouldn't engage with. Um, many young people have very low self-esteem and don't really see a future, particularly in the areas that they live. So trying to um, provide them with opportunities in order to build resilience is key. Uh, the relationships that I, I would have with young people are very uh, different than maybe they would have had before. I mean, uh, previously in, in my role as youth worker, the group was always the key focus. Obviously, the individuals within the group was something that um, was always in, in the forefront of, of your mind, but dealing with those young people uh, meant creating time a lot of time outside of work uh, in order to, to meet their needs. This role uh, and this uh, START programme enables me to spend significant time with individuals, become the significant adult in their life or one of the significant adults in their lives to help them understand where they are and, 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 and promote their understanding of where they can go, um, helping them reach their full potential. Making the decision to become a start outreach worker was something that was a big challenge for me. However, I was at a crossroads in, in my professional career and was given the opportunity to take part in some very good training. Um, it's called the Circle of Courage, um, working with young people reclaiming youth at risk. Um, and as a result of taking part in that training, I really understood where my next challenge was going to be. Coming from the place that I came from, I really seen the value in helping and supporting young people that came from a similar place where I came from. The value of the START pro program cannot be underestimated, particularly the potential of it. I mean, we know right now it's, it's in the early, the early stages, um, and in the area that I'm working with, the, the community um, capacity isn't particularly strong right now. Um, but I, I, I see the potential. I, I have a vision where the place where I am um, is, is going to grow and grow and grow. The young people are amazing. They have so much potential. However, um, the community, the, the agencies around them are not building the scaffolding that they need to reach where they are very much capable of, of, of going. My role, my role and what I'm passionate about is really getting to know the young people, getting to the heart of their issues and building long-term, uh, meaningful and trustful relationships. Short-term interventions, in my opinion, with these young people will not work. But the important thing is that they know that you're available, that you can meet them for a cup of tea and talk about a minor issue or something that's so significant that's having a huge impact on their life. I mean, recently, um, I've been able to take young people to appointments, to CAMS, collecting mothers along with the child to take them to doctor's appointments just to ease the stress. These young people, a lot of them, have had a lot of trauma in their lives and spending time with them, helping them understand that the things in their lives doesn't need to determine who they are in the future and who they are now.